Hello good afternoon and welcome we're coming to you live from the Oman Cricket Academy day 3 match number 3 of the ITW Universe Tri Nation T20 series a must win for Oman eh, as they take on a formidable Afghan Abdalian News from the toss is that Oman have won the toss and they've elected to have a bowl first. A couple of changes for both the sides. First up, uh, you can see a change up front here. Sedikullah misses out and this means that Wafiul Atharatil comes in. So does K Zemat. Two players missing out from last evening's fixture: Nan Gyal Karoti and Sedikullah Atal for Afghan Abdalian. Meanwhile, coming to Oman, a eh? Akibilia Suleri will want his boys to fire today. change for him as well in the top kashyap kumar prajapati coming in and so is rafiul and the players missing out in this encounter ayan khan and khalid kale as well all set for play Empire Gopu Kumar in your frame and he signals play we are all set for match 3 a must win for Romane Kalimullah steaming in Zubairul Akbari on strike here we go slash slash hard gets an outside edge first boundary here for Afghan Abdalian and for Rafiul as well a little streaky but they'll all count Wanted to go big, misses the line completely. Poor shot selection. The little dynamite, Shakil Ahmed, strikes for Omane. Well, he's got a game in this uh, encounter, but he's thrown it away. Wafiul Latarakil, a nothing shot, played all over it. You miss, I hit. Going across the line, he can look at the surface, but he'll not really look at that shot of his because he's played a terrible shot. Leave it with himself. He walks back for seven and six. He goes big, and looks like he's got the distance as well on this one. What a way to get off the mark! Talk about class coming to the fore, and Darvish Rasooli has made his intentions clear. What a shot! On the pads, a nicely managed. Some work for Sufyan Mahmood. No stopping. Lightning cook outfield, helping Zubaid to fetch that boundary. Leaking runs in his second over, going for plenty of runs. Shakil Ahmed. A flighted delivery, nicely managed. No chance for the mid-off fielder into the gap through the offside. Four runs. There it is. This time though, goes over the bowler's head. No half measures. Picked the length very early. Full follow through of the bat, and he moves into the twenties now. Darvish. Once again, keeping it out, and of course, Jatinder Singh will pull out a tie five because he's picked up a wicket out of nowhere. Left-hander. Zubairullah was struggling and was looking to go big, clear the infield. But all he manages to do it is hold out to Jatinder Singh, and probably got the bottom of the bat to mid off. Jatinder was never going to be dropping something as such as that, and this is a very very important wicket in the context of this game. He departs for eight of fourteen. Very comfortable keeping it away from the left-handed fielder. And just like that, it's a very, very soft manner. Shahidullah Kamal gets off the mark with a boundary. Once again, this time to the left of Kashyap Kumar Prajapati at point, and this time with conviction. Shahidullah Kamal loves the area Rafiullah is offering him at the moment. Plays it off his hips and hits clear the fielder. There was some pace behind that ball, and it's a quick outfield this afternoon at the Oman Cricket Academy. Darvish Rasooli is looking to continue attacking, all guns blazing. Full delivery. This time he's lofted it into the air. No long off in place. However, even if there was one, would have been absolutely unnecessary because all he would have to do is fetch the ball outside the fence. Looks for a wonderful sweep shot. Right behind square, and Darvish Rasooli seems to be in some mood this afternoon. On the back foot, an all-important single has been taken. Running hard, no chance for that second. But what matters? 
He's a 50 coming up for Darvish Rasuli. He's back in form. He was struggling in this series with the bat. But the captain has announced his arrival here in Oman Cricket Academy. Using the feet against Dishan Maksud. Nicely managed. Put it in the gap through the offside. Four runs for Shahidullah Kamal and more runs for Afghan Abdalian. He has been impressive in this series. A look at that brilliant running and is there a chance? A suicidal run. Testing the field. Good release by KP and good collection at the stems by Sufyan Mahmood. An underarm throw. Oh yes, gone for all money. Shaidullah has to walk back. This is brilliance in the field. Great teamwork between Kashyap Kumar Prajapati. That red light will be on and Sufyan as well. And they account for the third wicket. A rush of blood here for Shaidullah. Push for the second. Darvish responded but fell short. Much needed breakthrough. Nicely carved away. Beautifully done. This is a lovely shot by a batter who is in sublime touch in the middle. Catch it. In the air. Is there a chance for Hamad Mirza? Oh, well connected this time. A boundary followed by a maximum. Now he's trying to raise the tempo of the runs here. Dispatch. Brilliant hit. Humongous towards that Oman Cricket Academy. He moves to 78. Using the feet. Glorious. Brilliant hit. Goes over the deep extra cover. The second maximum in this over. He moves to 84 in no time. Dancing down the track. And this has come from the meat of the bat. This ball is sailing and sailing really long. Right into the car park. That car park is really far from the way. The place the wicket is. And this is some incredible striking from Karim Jannad here. From a brilliant 100 is Darvish. Make it 9 with that boundary. He moves to nervous 90s. A brilliant hit. No look shot. Jannat sending Kalim to the hell here. Towards the deep square leg. What a hit. The long guess 6 we have seen towards the deep square leg region from Karim Jannat. Big hit. On to the leg side, there's a fielder who's going to watch it sail over his head. This is the first hundred of the Tri-Nation T20 series. What a knock from Darvish Rasuli. 101 of 54 deliveries. He kisses the earth in delight. What a knock is this from Darvish Rasuli. Incredible striking, incredible power hitting. And this is impeccable from Darvish Rasuli here. No look once again, over oh, fine leg on this occasion. He's making a misery of the Zaman A bowling attack. He's enjoying the surface at the Oman Cricket Academy. Looking for a big one once again. Inside edge. The ball is traveling and traveling quickly to the boundary. This will be a boundary to add on to Karim Jandar once again. Might be off the inside edge and he wouldn't mind it. Another no look shot. This is traveling. What is this? He's making a habit out of this. Right onto the maintenance store. This is some wonderful striking from Karim Jannat. In the process, he gets to his 50 as well. And what a knock is this from Karim Jannat. Incredible striking. Everything from the meat of the bat. Back of the hand. It does not matter. This one's traveling as well. They're hitting sixes at will here. And everything is dispatching out of the ground. This is some striking at its best from Afghan Abdalian here. Block hole. This is hit straight. Long off will not be in the picture. It's gone, sailed over him. This is not the highlights package. This is a live match. And they have got boundaries at will here. Afghan Abdalian will finish off with a maximum here. Azad KR signals yes. play. We are all set for ball one in the chase. In hot pursuit of 2-1-2. Kashyap on strike. Begins with the loose. No first runs. Curtsy and extra. 
for Roman. That's the delivery that we were talking about, the one that comes in, plays across the line, Bilal strikes, Kashyap departs for a duck. Trouble times for Oman as Kashyap Kumar Prajapati departs and departs early. Looking to heave it across the line. Kashyap Kumar Prajapati has been castled on a duck. One for one Oman. Onto the mid-wicket area. Vacant. This is going to be travelling. This is going to be the first boundary for Oman here. That will calm the nerves down. Nicely driven. Sublime hit through covers. Staying deep in his crease, fetches a boundary at Shoaib. They'll need more of it. Forces the issue once again in the gap. The ball will win the chase. Back to back boundaries. Two elegant hits from the bat of Shoaib Khan. Much to the delight of the dugout as well. And that's where they need to be a little courageous. That's exactly what Shoaib Khan does in the air over mid wicket. Believe it's gone all the way. This is some good striking. Impactful striking from Shoaib Khan here. Another elegant hit over the infield. Great improvisation. Oman very much in this chase and great signs of ex aggression and execution in the middle. Pulls it. Straight to the fielder and it's been taken. Flat catch. What a start here for Faridun. Jatinda dismissed. Moving his eyes off the ball. And that ball was travelling flat as an arrow. Keeping his eye on the ball was Shahidullah. Jatinder saying departs and departs after a low score once again. 7 of 7 for him. 36 for the loss of 2 is Omane. That's been picked away. Fine up in a circle. What a way to get off the mark. As easy as it gets. Almost dragged that on. Runs again, racing away to the fine boundary. Four more. Eight runs have come behind the wicket here for Hake Bilyas. He'll not complain. Runs are coming thick and fast here for Roman. Very interesting over, which has been made even more interesting. This has just come out of nowhere. Hake Bilyas just holding his ground and said, no, I don't want to be dealing in singles or doubles. Beautiful delivery. And stranded midway. Gone for all money. Ake Bilyas is stranded and distraught. And he'll be really unhappy about that. There was no way a run there. Shoaib Khan, the moment he hit the ball, he knew that that one was travelling fast to the fielder at mid of Ake Bilyas, looking and itching to rotate strike. I think Shoaib should have been more aware, knowing that he had played straight towards the mid off. A wicket going down in the shape of a run out. Big man Aki Bilya, the captain of Omane, departs. Not afraid to toss it up. This time he's dealt with it severely down the ground. He's going to get as many as four runs. Shoaib Khan has a lot of ground to cover at the moment. Goes down on one knee and connects well towards that core corner. And looking good and dangerous with the bat. Shoaib moves to 45. Once again, charging down the track. And it's, I think, better because it's higher and hit harder. With that, he'll also come to his 50. Big, big, big shot on offer. It's well taken, a deep mid wicket. This is some very good catching from Afghan Abdalian. Flight delivery went down on his knee. Got the toe end of the bat. Activated the field and the deep. Timing of the jump. Brilliant. Lovely catch. By the captain Darvesh Rasuli. Zishan departs for six. Inside out once again. He loves that area. Especially against Kes. Playing it with the spin. Inside out. Over the fielder at cover. In the arc, in the air, there's a fielder coming underneath it. He'll only watch a tail over his head. By merest of margins, this is a maximum, much needed maximum from the bat of Shoaib Khan. He was silent for a while, he was away from the strike. Shot pulled straight to the fielder at short fine. This is the worst way to be departing to a very classical knock from Shoaib Khan. He was looking really, really good. Didn't get too much of pace on that. Was it the slower bouncer? Didn't quite come on to him. 
the way he would have liked it to. Soft dismissal, Jannat gives him the send-off. He's delighted. He's been amongst runs and wickets, Kareem Jannat. But what an innings by Shoaib Khan. Late cut and played well. There's some covering to be done. Not on this occasion. Hamad Mirza gets a first boundary at this level for himself. And he will have some nerves coming down. Pulled just wide of shot fine. He's come in some mood here in the middle. Back to back boundaries for Hamad Mirza here. Big one, big one, big one on offer from Hamad Mirza. Fielder coming underneath it and what a catch is this. Incredible catch from KS Ahmed. Had to run it from long off, was standing on the edge of the rope. That was played towards extra cover. Puts in the dive. Brilliance. Excellent fielding and catching. Hamad Mirza walks back for 12. Curtsy. An absolute cracker of a catch by KS. Charging down the track. Sensing some urgency here. Vinayak Shukla has got some runs in the recent past and he's continuing to get a few more to his name. A good boundary. Bilal Sami is welcomed with a huge one towards the onside. Vinayak Shukla now looking to take things in his own hands and getting a few runs for himself. But this an advantage to the bowlers. And in the meanwhile, a brilliant shot. Gutsy knock from Vinayak Shukla continues. This time just punched it towards the covers. It was in the air and Darvish Rasuli will have something else to talk about other than that explosive innings that he played in the first innings. And that is a very simple regulation catch. A good cameo comes in and trying to play inside out. Not much pace offered and a good catch taken by the captain and a good send off by the bowler. Final delivery and Rafiola just manages to convert that into a single as we bring an end to proceedings here in the second innings. Afghan Abdalian have registered a comprehensive victory over Romane as they end up with only 167 for 7. Falling short by as many as 44 runs. And that's the margin of victory that the Abdalians will be really feeling good about because that means they've completed a couple of games with some authoritative performances.